Victoria, today we have so much. It's a book written by Trish Cook and illustrated by Ellen Oxenberry. And it's a book I love. You'll see. This is the end paper. And this is the baby. And it's got a teddy bear. And the baby has the wide, the, the arms wide open. They weren't doing anything, Mum and the baby. Nothing really. Then, ding dong! Oh, Mummy looked at the door. The baby looked at Mum. It was. And one big, big smile. Oh, she said, I want to squeeze him. I want to squeeze the baby. I want to squeeze him so much. And they sat, and she sat on her knee to play. Clap, clap, stand your foot. And she read him a book. Hmm. They weren't doing anything, Mum and the baby and Auntie Biba. Nothing really. Then, ding dong! Oh! Mum looked at the door. Auntie Biba looked at the baby. The baby looked at Mum. And it was. Uh, Uncle! It was Uncle Diddy! Uncle Diddy came inside with his eyebrows raised high, 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 and his lips scrunched up. Small, 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 hello, hello, he said. I want to kiss him. I want to kiss the baby. I want to kiss him so much. And he put the baby on his shoulders and it fell shaky, shaky, flip, flap over him and he nearly dropped him. Hiya! They weren't doing anything. Mum and the baby and Auntie Beaver and Uncle Didi. Nothing really. And then, ding dong! Oh! yo ho yo ho Mum looked at the door, Uncle Didi looked at Auntie Biba, Auntie Biba looked at the baby, and the baby looked at Mum, and it was... Oh, it was Nanny! Nanny and Gran Gran! Nanny and Gran Gran came inside with their handbags, you see the handbags, cocked up to one side, and their brolly hook up on the sleeve, Yoo-hoo! Yoo-hoo-hoo! They said, I want to eat him. Mm, yummy, yummy. I want to eat the baby. I want to eat him so much. And look at the baby. The baby's happy. And they hug him. And they love him. And they make him feel so cozy, singing songs and dancing till it was time for sleeping. Now the house is crowded, eh? They weren't doing anything. Mum and the baby and Auntie Beeb and Uncle Didi and Nanny and Grand Grand. Nothing really. Then, ding dong! Hey, poo poo! Mum looked at the door. Nanny looked at Grand Grand. Grand Grand looked at Uncle Didi. Uncle Didi looked at Uncle Didi Biva and Auntie Biva looked at the baby and the baby looked at Mum and he was Cousin Cousin KK Hey bro and big cousin Ross Cousin KK came inside and he spin up his hat round and round and he go he do like the riding horse he giddy 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 up Hey, poo poo, he said. I want to fight him. I want to fight the baby. I want to fight him so much.
And they wrestle, and they wrestle, and he pushed the baby first, the baby hit him back. He gave the baby pinch, the baby gave him slap, and they laugh and laugh and laugh. Ha, 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 ha. And the house was full, 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 and they sit down there waiting for the next ding dong. They wait and they wait and it never came. Mummy said, is everybody all right? And the baby and cousin start to fight again. Nanny and Grand Grand take out carts and dominoes. Uncle Didi start to slap them down on the table. And Auntie Dida play some records really loud. Mum said, what madness all around. They weren't doing anything, Mum and the baby and Auntie Beeb and Uncle Didi and Nanny and Grand Grand and Cousin KK. Nothing really. Then ding dong! I'm home! And everybody stopped. Mum picked the baby up and they all wait by the door. Surprise! Everybody said and Mum said, Happy birthday, Daddy! And everybody joined in what a celebration then daddy rubbed the baby face against his whiskers on his chin and mom brought in the food she'd been cooking and they were celebrating and dancing and singing and eating and hugging everybody enjoyed the party and when it was time for them to go and everybody tired, the baby wanted to play some more. Mom said, no. She put him to bed, but the baby played bounce, bounce with Ted. And he remembered everybody saying how they wanted to squeeze, to kiss eat and fight him because they loved him so much and that's the end of our story i hope you like it as much as i do <laughs>